But I was hanging out in some um, park downtown. And somebody mistook me for a baby, their baby, mm -hmm. took me home and breastfed me. <laughs> Wasn't it like a medical miracle that they gave birth to a disgusting old man? They thought it was the Benjamina Button type of thing. Benjamina! <laughs> I'm gonna have, if, I'm, if I'm gonna have a baby as a celebrity, the name I'm gonna pick is gonna be such an affront. It, it's gonna make Apple look like Beth. Oh God. Mary, it's gonna be, this, this, is, my, this is my son. Don't do it, don't do it, Jackie. Got Prius? No, my how daughter about Mark? Don't do a weird name. Mary, Don't the way her name's gonna be Silk or something ridiculous. With three L's. <laughs> yes. This is my daughter. Silky Nutmeg Ganache. Hi, would you like me to be the queen of your universe? Trixie Mattel. And honey, did it hurt? Are your arms tired? Why? From, from flying all the way up from hell? <laughs> Hi, I'm Katya. <laughs> that was my pickup line. Ooh. Ooh. And welcome to uh, the show where we talk about whatever we want. Because it's our show. <laughs> yeah. That was a not yours. And not yours. And then, <laughs> boop, boop, beep, doop, boop. <laughs> <laughs> ah, it was, it was, it was, it was. Ah. I think we got it. Freaky, what? You don't have to worry about, but I've been, I wasn't feeling sexy for a while, and now I'm a, I'm a, something's coming. What are you talking about? I'm having another period. A renaissance? Yeah, I'm gonna start sucking again. Oh, good, good. Just get that monkey pox, Mary. Mary, I can't even get the first shot. I applied for it and they said no, because no, you're you not just, slutty enough, and then I applied up. again and they said there's none in your area. Speaking of monkeypox, let's talk about seduction. All right, seduction was a girl group in the eighties. Um, I know, I know that we're going to talk about real seduction, but can I tell you just a little bit about Michelle Visage? I would love. I, that's what I thought we were going to talk okay. about. Okay. So if you don't know, Michelle Visage was in a band called Seduction. When I was getting ready to do Queen of the Universe, mm -hmm. I read the the Diva Rules yep. because I didn't really know that much about Michelle. Right. The sections about seduction are so wild. I was in the middle of reading a bunch of Stephen King books, so it was like Carrie, Cujo. The Diva ah! Rules. Well, Cujo and Seduction are very similar. There, that Sam Bernard was originally in Seduction. It takes two to make a thing go. <laughs> <laughs> well, and that was that was Seduction. There was a, there was this movie called The Last Seduction with Linda Fiorentino. They used to air on HBO and he used to jump off to it. Let's take a break. <laughs> Coming soon to stores everywhere. Hi. I know you're probably wanted back at the home. Because I saw you on the news. And I saw you dressed in that Santa suit, chopping up that family. And I wondered if you would like to axe wound my axe wound. Seduction. A new fragrance from the makers of Sympathy. A smell for a woman that knows how to get what she needs. I'm so sorry to bother you, but I walked in here and saw you sitting there like that, wearing that thing, and I couldn't help but think to myself, is that a whore? Seduction. Because I would like, like to hire you for sex, because mm -hmm. you're so beautiful, there's no way I could ever have sex with you, not for money. Mm -hmm. Are you a whore? May I please rent your whore body for sex? <laughs> Seduction. Comes in an eight ounce bottle or a gallon jug. How much money do you have? Sixty dollars. Yeah. Okay. You've got yourself a deal, Miss 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 Mattel. You know my name already. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> but I'll tell you this. I would say that there are these fleeting moments out of drag mm -hmm. where I know what time it is and I exercise my rights. I remember um, waiting at David's first date. Mm. We were at the Roger Room in Los Angeles. And if we ever have a child, I think I'm gonna try to name the child Roger. I remember where we had drunk. Okay, delicious conversation. He's smiling, has big, beautiful teeth. <laughs> and then I'm like, halfway through the night, I'm like, so there's this couple over there, and it looks like they're, they moved to the same side of the booth and they're making out. And I remember he was like, well, why are you, what are you waiting for? And it was like- So you went and made out with them? I moved to the other side of the booth and made out with him. Yes, I had my hand on his pants at a public place. Wow. Yeah. That's really- But he made a move, he seduced. He said, well, what are you waiting for? 
Oh, and I, I said, see. Oh, well, it's like when someone says, oh my God, that's such a beautiful dress. And I say, it looks better on the floor. Oh my God, you right? say that? No, I don't, but some certain but, And then you do. lay down. Yeah, and I thought, it looks better on the floor. And then you lay down and it's a chalk circle around your dead body. <laughs> I would say, in drag, because I'm not ever really trying to have sex in drag, mm -hmm. I wouldn't say that seducing anyone occurs to me. But because it's certainly possible. The only people that are trying to f me in drag are, are teenage girls. lesbians. Yeah. So I'm kind of like 0 for 2. Yeah. But if we're talking about using my beauty, my body, my height, my perfume, my... Ooh, Your feminine wiles. My... Ooh, to, to command the room. Guilty. <laughs> Do you think it's mad? Seduce the room. Just I the won't room. Seduce oh, a yeah, person. the world. <laughs> the you know what I mean? Sure. <laughs> like, I want you to not be able to take your eyes off me, but I don't want you to feel like there's an opportunity for you to touch me at any point. Okay. Look, but don't touch. Shh. Memoirs of a woman who's a man <laughs> in a wig. That's me. Oh, this is a hot pickup line. What about this? You're at the bar, okay. you're a man, I'm a woman. Mm. Okay, yeah, doing what men do, which is apparently voguing. Okay. The, oh, I'm the man now. Yeah, you're the man. Oh, okay. And I go, you haven't seen me yet. And I go, I know you haven't looked at me yet because I've been behind you since I walked in, but I want you to know when I cross in front of you and you can unable to take your eyes off me, I want you to know that I'm gonna like it. Oh my God. And then. Wow, that was very powerful. Can I show I you my version? Your mind I didn't like. <laughs> then you leave him wanting more, and then then you go. <laughs> well, I feel like you want to blow in the ear softly, but that's a little subtle. So you really want to like, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my this is my version. Freeze! Don't move. I just need you to know that what I'm about to do is going to be so erotic that you're not going to be able to handle it. But just listen closely to my every word. I'm going to turn and face in front of you. And there's gonna be a huge brown stain on my trousers. And it's from me in my pants earlier. It's gonna smell like 13 dozen babies themselves all at once on a hot car. That's, I think that's all I got. Okay. Is that good? And then do you ever go in front of me? No, oh, I just okay. leave, because then I get tired. What about this when you're in a public place and you go to your betrothed and you go, you meet in the bathroom in 15 minutes. And they come in and you're blowing up that porcelain. You're <laughs> you like, want them to, like, I didn't say what to eat me for. You want them to pop in and grow in on your back. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> but beauty subjective. For example, this is some people's, it's their jump it's scare. Their trauma response. Jump scare. It's their trigger warning. <laughs> yeah. It's their jump scare. But this is some people's like, I'm immediately afraid I'm gonna <laughs> in front of all my friends. Well, they said the same thing about Cindy Crawford before she got really big. How big does she get? <laughs> Seduction really takes place in person. In the I first think. 10 seconds. Yeah. You know, this is what you're doing. You go. Hee haw. Boom. I mean, I'm not as a boy, not as a boy, but as a girl, very seductive. Very seductive. Oh, super what's, confident. Okay, you're out of super. drag. What's your seductive? What's what's your dance? I kind of go straight, like, I go right up to them direct. Mm -hmm. um, I usually make it like an offhanded comment about being attracted to them. It's usually received as a joke. Like they think I'm joking. I've seen it happen. Many I've times. I've seen it a lot. And it's like, I was like, oh, just so you know, I'm not joking. I'm not joking, bitch. I heard you say, I'm very attracted to you and that's not a joke, I'm not joking. And they go, ha ha ha, oh you. Like, yeah. that's their way of being like, grandma, put your wig back on <laughs> and quit trying to me like it's really we're at bingo right now bitch yeah and you need to take some more metamucil <laughs> oh my gosh now it's time for our favorite part of the episode where we answer your questions these questions were tweeted at world of wonder using the hashtag well help me wow there's this cute veterinarian who comes into my work and i think he's gay how should i flirt with him or if i should at all well, first you gotta get a pet, and you gotta you gotta get that pet's health in the dumps. Yeah, well, go dumpster diving for like an aging, you know, throwaway kitten or whatever. Yeah, I'll get like a, a street, a common street rat, put a leash on it, and go. I think there's something wrong with my dog. Or better yet, I'll put on some cat ears and and, and won't shower and just take me to the vet. Yeah, and you'll get a full day in the office because I'll you're... be able to tell if they're gay or not. It's very simple. What? Next time he comes into your work, say. Do you like gay sex? <laughs> I mean, maybe. I love doing gay sex, especially with someone whom I'm attracted to. Go to the veterinarian's office. See what office they work in. Oh, are you a vet? Why do you have a pet? Well, I used to have a couple of gerbils. 
but they just went right at my when they suffocated and died. <laughs> I had to fish him out with a crochet hook. Oh, oh, I think there's another one in there. Would you mind? <laughs> um, good luck. Yeah, good luck. If this helped you, great. If it didn't, tweet your questions at World of Wonders and the hashtag well help me. Are you afraid of rejection? Not at all. Yeah. Not at all. If you don't want to have sex with me, I also don't want you to have sex with me. Like, like I, I, you get it. Seduction is all fun and games until someone gets, you know, real hard. Yeah, and you know, seduction is also hand in hand with um, consent, because if you seduce and you slowly unveil your interest, there's a lot of ways to read whether or not it's welcomed. I like to just put my breasts in the window every morning. Thick plate of, you know, very thick window, but everybody can see them and they know they're there. Yeah, what about this? What about this? Mm. You want to come up to room 104 or are we going to keep pretending like you don't want to open me up? What about that? Is that too much? I, oh, that's yeah. too much. Like, like, so how long is this charade gonna go on for? Which charade? The the charade where you're not pounding my <laughs> until it's a, until an unrecognizable my life has been extinguished. <laughs> uh, yeah, something subtle, kind of like. What are you doing later? Oh. It's kind of like halfway there. Hi. Yeah, like it's not even words. It's more yeah, like. like <laughs> The volume lets them know what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. And then like, I read body language, and yeah. if it's right, then I'll do it's like Ooh. <laughs> go deep. Yeah. I usually. Like, <laughs> well, like, who am I kidding? If they want me, they want a, they want someone with a penis with a wig on. So what is deepening the voice? They know what time it is. I I'm not the witness protection program. No. I think you, right now you look, pardon my French, very seductive. Oh. Look at these shoulders. Look at those legs. What about, what about that? Oh, that ruins it. That ruins it. Do uh, I look like Diane Sawyer? You look like I'm Diane Sawyer. Is that how she talks? No. You know my accents are. I, they're, I mean, it's wow. Yeah. Diane, is that you? Um, who do you look like? I got something to share with you. It's between my legs. That's how Cher would seduce. You know, 